So we got some questions for you today. We have about seven questions. So are you ready? I am totally ready. Awesome. Bring it on. Right. Can you just please introduce yourself by stating the name, the business name, and what's your relationship to this business? And just introduce yourself. So, my name's Hanalea Ching. I am the owner, you could say founder of MD Lash Studio. My team, okay, so my team is awesome. Yeah. Love them. So, my accounts manager, social media manager is Maverick Fawalo. <laughs> and then my inventory specialist is Presley Ray Linkildi. And my advisor is Dakota Tyler Linkildi. And that's my team. What are the principles, morals, values, simply your belief system that you live and stand by? I think I eat, sleep, breathe God. Born and raised into this church, my grandparents, pastors, have been for a really long time. That has instilled in me that without God, nothing is possible. With God, anything is possible. I feel like at that point in my life is, you know what, this is my love and passion for making women feel beautiful inside and out. And that's just basically my goal. What are some of your hobbies outside of owning your business being a flash tech? I guess if you call shopping a hobby, that's me. Definitely love shopping. That retail therapy does it every time. I feel like sometimes you just have to love yourself, show yourself some love and spend the day with yourself. Since I'm a mom of three, four, yeah, four. <laughs> my main hobby, you know, is just loving myself and showing myself that grace every day as moms. When working a traditional nine to five job, what were the types of jobs you were doing before owning your own business? Let's see, how much time do you have? <laughs> First off, <laughs> I just wanna put it out there that I did start in the car dealership business. Uh, I, I was 18 all the way up until like 36. And from there, I just learned everything. Part-time receptionist, to full-time employee, to 700 accounts, to being the right hand to the owner of the dealerships, running five dealerships. So yeah, you kind of get like an experience of customer service, you know, surveys, everything. So I just utilize everything that I learned from there into running my business. I feel like at the end of the day, praying my way through this, getting God in the center of my business, I'm already a success. I love that. Was that it for that? Oh yeah, for sure. Will you share exactly what it was for you that sparked your interest to getting into your own business and into this particular kind of industry? So I'd say when you're that little girl sitting on the toilet watching your mom do her makeup, you're just so fascinated by your mom, her beauty and, and, and all of her, right? And doing the gloss and all of that. I feel like it did something for me. I loved it. And then one day I turned 13, she gave me a money piece and the rest is history. Now I'm over here running my lash business. I want to help women achieve their goal of feeling beautiful and matching the inside. The second to last question is just paint us the vision. Mm -hmm. Where do you see yourself growing as a person and as a business within two to five years? I'd say in two years, I want to be a strong businesswoman slash mom. I feel like this business is my baby, but I also know right now taking the time to run my business and put my whole focus into it. I feel like if it comes down to having my clients feel loved, feel seen, feel heard, just create a space for them to come and just, you know, take that nap, just relax and the, having that peace of mind for two to three hours, I would love for them to do that. And I would love to create a space for that. But I also want them to feel God's love. The minute you step in my studio, you feel one with God and that peace. Like at the end of the day, that's all I want for my clients is just to have that relationship. Wow. That was like one of the best answers today. Our last question, if you had anything else to share, some final thoughts and encouragements to those watching and listening online, what would it be? Huh, okay, so if you are a working mom, working that nine to five and you have an idea of something you wanna do or a business you wanna get up and running, I'd say just go for it, just do it. Because life is too short and right now we never know what's gonna happen tomorrow. I would just get in there, have a plan, but most importantly, I would say pray your way through the day. Pray your way through the process because it will get hard and there'll be days you wanna throw in the towel and then there'll be days that are like big wins. Keep moving forward, pray, and know that God is watching you and you'll succeed. I feel like at the end of the day, you will succeed. And just keep pushing.
Thank you so much for joining me today. I'm so excited to see some of you guys or all of you in my lash bed. Please stay tuned. I have so many wonderful things coming up, so much exciting events, even giveaways. So please stay watching. God bless you guys. And until then, much love.